Hello French Road families! Today is Friday, February 15th and it is our last day before winter break next week. So just a reminder, you probably are aware of this, but just in case you're not, we have no school next week. So we will not be back in school until a week from Monday. So I hope you're doing something fun, wonderful, relaxing, whatever works for your family and we look forward to seeing everyone back here in a little over a week. When we do come back after break, we are going to be jumping right into our Read Across America Spirit Week. So in the family newsletter this week, I put a picture with all of the details about our Spirit Week sponsored by Student Council to raise our excitement for reading. And our week will end on March 1st with guest readers in all of the kids' classrooms. So that's pretty cool. Coming up the week after that on March 6th is our Brighton Believes Day. And this year on Brighton Believes Day, French Road is going to focus on Brighton Believes in Kindness. All students in the entire school are going to make kindness rocks. More information to come about that, but there is a link in my newsletter if you are interested in ordering a shirt for yourself or for your kids um, that says Fres Rocks, because obviously we do, and the orders have to be in by February 18th in order to be here by um, Brighton Believes Day. So if you're interested in that, we only have a few days left to order a shirt, so just keep that in mind. The link's right in the newsletter. After break, we have a PTSA meeting with the principal on February 26th at 9.30 here at French Road in the cafeteria and our uh, instructional coaches from French Road, our math science technology coach and our literacy coach will be here talking about Fred's assessment practices. So if you're interested in hearing more about assessment practices at Fred's, you can stop in that day. Our movie night is rescheduled to March 21st, so we didn't have to get rid of Mr. Lemoncello's library. Luckily, we found another day that worked. We're super excited, March 21st. And open houses are shifting dates. So our third grade open house will remain on March 7th. Our entire fourth grade open house is now March 14th. And our fifth grade open house is going to actually move right into June on the day that we celebrate our fifth graders moving on to TCMS. They'll do a celebration of student learning in their classrooms on June 20th. So check that out in the newsletter as well. Lots of info today. And I have the loveliest third graders here with me today from Mrs. Cannon's class. And they're going to start by introducing themselves and then telling you a little bit about a project they worked on with students from Brighton High School. Zaya, take it away. Hi, my name is Zaya. Hi, my name is Anna. Hi, my name is Megan. Hi, my name is Holden. Hi, my name is Holden. All right, these awesome kids worked on a project with students from Brighton High School. And Anna is going to tell us a little bit about that. high school students connected with our third grade class learned a little bit more about what they were knew or didn't know about forces in motion and then they created and you guys can share boys why don't you start and share some of the books that you have there so um the high schoolers sent the books and they're all about like physics some are like cartoonish that like in a fun way of learning and so in the books, they they um, taught lessons of lessons about physics and motions. Great. Do you guys want to share anything else? Um, no. What did you think about the project? It was really fun. Yeah. And I liked writing. To the high school. Yeah, it was great connecting with all the students from the high school, wasn't it? Doing the chatter kid. Yeah, the chatter picks. That was awesome too. Yeah. So great connection with from French Road to Brighton High School. Have a wonderful weekend, have a wonderful break, and we'll see you when we get back. Bye. 